And the count is no balls and one strike. Cornelius Randolph hitting 307, two home runs and 16 runs batted in. Randolph was three for five last night where the run scored. Cougars totaled 15 hits as a team. Here's the 0-1 pitch. Ground ball to the right side, tough play. It's through to right field for a base hit. De La Trinidad scores. They're going to wave Johnson around. Here's a throw by Max Murphy, and it's not in time. Johnson scores standing up. Randolph advances to second. Cornelius Randolph with a two-run single through the right side. And three batters into the game. The Cougars have taken a 2-0 lead. A look back at second, the 0-1 pitch. High fly ball to left. It's deep. Back goes Rivera to the warning track. He looks up, and it's gone. Jimmy Kerrigan hits his third home run over the last two nights, his ninth of the season, a two-run shot to left center field, and the Cougars lead it 4-0 in the top half of the first. So on 0-1, Kerrigan elevates one into the very strong winds out towards left field. Barasa's 1-2 pitch, line shot the other way, slicing, it drops in fair for a base hit. De La Trinidad into third, they'll bring him around. De La Trinidad will score. Sherman Johnson on two strikes, an RBI single the other way to left. And the Cougars now lead at 5 0 in the top half of the second. The 2 1. Ground ball right side, the chance in the holy field. He goes to second for one. Navarro wants a first, and it's in time for the double play. And the inning is over. 1 2 pitch. Line drive towards the gap in left center field. All the run is ran up, going back. He won't get it. It's over his head and bouncing towards the wall. La Chance are out third will score and pulling in at second with an RBI double is Raul Navarro. The goal eyes are on the board at five to one in the bottom half of the third. Bishop will still work out of the stretch. The L1 pitch, Murphy drives it in the air to deep left center field. Randolph going back to the winning track, to the wall, and a one hops off the bottom of the wall. Navarro scores, and Murphy pulls it at second with a two at RBI double. It's now five to two, Kane County, here in the bottom half of the third inning. Barras is ready. And the 1-1 pitch, slider grounded out to shortstop. Navarro fields, goes to second for one, the chance to first, and it's in time for the double play. Pinales is ready. And the pitch, slider grounded off the mound, moving forward, Navarro, he's got it, steps on second, throws to first and plenty of time for the double play. And the inning is over. The Gold Eyes turn two for a third time tonight. Vargas to the windup. And the 1-0 pitch, line drive, base it into right field. De La Trinidad scores. Johnson is held at third. Murphy's throw cut off by Logan Hill. It's an RBI single to right for Josh Roulette. And the Cougars add on at 6-2 King County in the top half of the ninth inning. The 3-1 pitch, hit in the air towards right center. On the run is Anderson with Kerrigan, and Anderson reaches, and then he make the catch, and he makes the catch, and the ball game is over. A running catch by Nick Anderson at right center, jumping over the diving Jimmy Kerrigan, and the Kane County Cougars win the rubber match of this three-game series over the Winnipeg Gold Eyes by a final score of 6-2. to two.